Hello again. Uh, last time is we finished the capability mapping model. Uh, so this time is uh, we are moved to this uh, figure 13 uh, to do the value stream capability cross mapping. Uh, when you do more and more uh, the argument uh, the modeling, uh, you may see uh, the more common thing is uh, the cross mapping. Uh, until now, is we did uh, primarily is on every single uh, aspect we do the modeling. But when you have uh, more elements, uh, cross mapping is more powerful uh, in the argument. Uh, not only within this uh, same layer, like a strategy layer. Uh, later on, you may see is, uh, uh, we will do some cross layer, like from the strategy to uh, business, from business to application to technology. So, that gave you uh, more power uh, storytelling uh, capability. Uh, so before we move to this, uh, primarily uh, when we analyze uh, this uh, view, uh, we can see uh, the major uh, relation uh, is connected to the upper level of the capability, uh, not go to the deeper level. Uh, and then we are using the serving uh, the, uh, this relation from the capability to value stage. Uh, before we do that, is uh, let's back to see. Uh, last time we finish uh, this number 12, uh, we have this, uh, uh, the structure of the uh, capability, uh, but well, we have a number of those capability in the root folder. Uh, my uh, recommendation is uh, under capability, you can create some folder structure uh, then do this uh, uh, the while element uh, the arrangements. Uh, so I, I did a few things, uh, but we can do this uh, rest uh, all together. Uh, so if you see here, uh, my uh, the, uh, the hobby is uh, I create the higher level capability here, uh, and then they use the same name to create the uh, the folder. Uh, then under this folder, you can see uh, these five uh, the underlined capabilities put in here. Uh, so this gave you some uh, the, uh, the benefits is uh, when you use the same folder, uh, the name as the capability, upper level capability name, uh, you can do the searching. Uh, like uh, when you do this uh, keyword searching, you get this capability and its folder. Uh, then you know it's uh, under this capability, there's a some sub capability. So, just for the convenient, uh, when you do the uh, the arrangements so, uh, for your capability element, and once you have this market, uh, actually the one a little tricky way is uh, you don't need to come to here to search that. You can select using the control, select and this highlight here. Uh, then you can drag that there to directly here. Uh, so that is a uh, easier way. So uh, similarly, is uh, uh, let me try to uh, make those uh, upper level things uh, selected, and then drag to the capability uh, folder. Uh, then what I uh, will do is uh, like sales uh, using the F2, and you can start to create a folder for here, and then you have this tool move to sales. And the customer, so you can follow me like this. Uh, create the same uh, folder. Then you can also drag our uh, this kind of uh, rectangle, and then move this uh, directly here. Uh, so that is uh, uh, more uh, the easier. So using F2, create a folder. Then select all these four track directly here, money, so create a folder, and track, that's the two, so this one, create a policy claim folder, select these two, and these four, sorry, and put here, that's the one, the business uh, support this folder, and you can select all of them. And business support is here, it's in drag here. 
it slightly so we have our separate marketing or oh, marketing we didn't uh, drag inside uh, to the capability folder then yeah let's save uh, so that is uh, one good uh, preparation uh, for the uh, this uh, cross mapping uh, but when you analyze here you can see here uh, policy and claim management is five uh, sub capability, uh, but under our uh, 12, uh, number 12 uh, figure, we only have uh, four. Uh, so what that means is uh, uh, you can kind of see it's a data driven uh, here is it's already created before, but not shown here. Uh, the reason is uh, number 12 uh, is mentioned by the case studies only the partial uh, the capability just for sampling so it's not the full capability uh, so this one uh, we can move to policy and same as digital customer management is uh, here this under the customer management uh, but the only uh, you move to here is not create uh, the relationship. Uh, so if you want uh, them is uh, really uh, the part of this uh, upper level things, uh, uh, you need to uh, drag uh, this part uh, capability inside and then choose the composition. Otherwise, is uh, when you select this one. So now when I select the digital customer things, I can see here is uh, see uh, analysis is composed inside the customer management. Uh, but uh, if I choose the data driven, it's not uh, have any relationship to policy and claim management. Uh, so that is the behavior for the R key. You need to uh, make that uh, uh, the relationship uh, visible in the view. Then that's uh, the creation for this relationship. Now you have uh, we have this. Uh, so actually, so we update this uh, number twelve uh, thing, uh, the figure, or, or the view. So, and now uh, we can use this uh, to create uh, the uh, this uh, number uh, thirteen. Uh, so we duplicate this uh, easier. So let's see. So create a value string capability cross mapping. What we need is here we we have a product, marketing, sales, policy, and the customer. So those we don't need. So this uh, four, uh, let's uh, clear that. Uh, and then to just uh, make that uh, easier, so is uh, they have some uh, real layout, but let, let's uh, keep uh, our, uh, saving our time. So uh, we can do this, and then is uh, let's drag our value stream. So we have our value stream here. So that is acquire insurance product, and we have. Uh, uh, our four value stream. So it's better is uh, you when you did that is uh, you have uh, them to drag inside directly. So uh, I can use this here. So those are the value stream. You can use uh, this uh, new way of the same uh, the shape, or, or if you want is you can use this uh, figure. To change that like this, uh, so that is the depend on is uh, what's your uh, preference. Uh, I just uh, use this one, uh, and then uh, let's be so from the product the management is uh, serving the develop product. Uh, let's use this one. So here develop product, uh, sales and the marketing serve the market and the sales product. Now let's uh, sh uh, you can use a shift price uh, serving. And you can see here is locked. So we can drag this, we can drag this. Uh, and then policy claim is in uh, serving the manage policy and the claim. So third one. And the last one, customer management, is uh, here. Uh, so use uh, ESC, you can unlock the, this uh, uh, the, uh, kind of this uh, relationship uh, uh, selection. Uh, so uh, I use the, this way to uh, make uh, the mapping here. Uh, I 
it's not to look the same, uh, but I, I think the most important uh, is not uh, the loop plan shape uh, view, uh, it's uh, the relationship itself. Uh, itself. So, uh, and as I also said, is uh, I try to prevent using this uh, junction. So, uh, I connect the market and um, our marketing sales distribution directly uh, from their uh, group to the uh, the uh, value stage. Uh, so that is uh, ensuring so you have the point-to-point -point relationship. And one more thing is uh, uh, before closing, I want to uh, mention is this is only show you the group of this capability linked to the value stream. Uh, but uh, when you uh, click uh, the specific sub capability, uh, so, uh, which means is uh, uh, if you want to see product definition, from the analysis, uh, you don't see it has any relation to the, this uh, value stream or, or value stage. Uh, it's only here uh, on the group. Uh, so in uh, our companies, uh, uh, our EA teams, day-to-day uh, -day practice, uh, actually it is, uh, if uh, there is a higher level connected is, uh, and you think the lower level is also applied, uh, normally, is, uh, we also do uh, some busy work like this. Uh, so that is uh, give you some uh, the hint is uh, if you choose uh, the lower level capability, uh, you will also uh, be able to see this uh, relationship. Uh, but that's only uh, applied is uh, if you are mapping uh, is uh, uh, same from the top level to the second uh, layer level. Uh, but in some cases, it's uh, uh, maybe only partial uh, of those uh, sub-levels are connected to uh, or realize or serving uh, to this uh, relationship, uh, then you should not use this a uh, simpler way. Uh, so uh, most of the uh, case is uh, we are starting to do the, uh, the cross-mapping from the lowest level of the, uh, the element. So which means is if we have knowledge, no, this uh, lower level capability is uh, serving this uh, another concept, then we can be sure is the inferring uh, the relationship is this upper level capability must serve this as well, uh, because uh, this lower level is uh, composed inside this upper level. Uh, but the vice versa uh, direction may not be always uh, correct. Uh, but for simpler reason is uh, you can consider is uh, how uh, your capability uh, can be easily connect to every cross layer uh, concept, uh, not only in the upper level uh, because you are uh, losing some uh, the detailed information. But that's uh, fully depends on your knowledge uh, of this uh, the view and the cross mapping. Uh, so next uh, uh, time is uh, we are starting to do the business uh, function. So uh, we uh, move to the business layer. Uh, so this is the last uh, view in the, uh, the strategy layer. But we will continue to see the strategy layers uh, element when we do the cross layer, uh, cross mapping uh, in the coming views. Uh, see you next time. Bye.